Hey guys, so this video will be covering uh, the section capacity and tension, the formula behind it, and also we'll be covering the phenomena known as uh, she lag and uh, eccentricity. Now, the basis of this section capacity intention is that we have to try to find a design capacity such that is greater or equal to the design load. Now, you see that our design capacity is actually reduced by a factor of 0 0.9 and this is uh, from the Australian standards. Right, so when we actually assess the second capacity intention we need to assess two failure modes uh, yield and fracture both of which have formulas as shown below where the yield fracture is the gross area times the yield stress uh, and the fracture uh, section capacity is 0 0.85 times a correctional factor KT times the net area times the fracture stress. This can be found in clause 7.1 and 7.2 of AS4100. Now the section capacity of any steel member in tension will be the minimum of the section capacity when it's yielding and the section capacity when it's fracturing. So whichever one is lower and more likely to occur. And so now we're going to move on to the to eccentricity and shear lag, which are phenomena that lead to uh, non-uniform stress distribution in steel members. Now they usually arise from uh, connecting.